what's going on YouTube and welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having a great start to your morning. Let's go ahead and crack this case wide open. So guys, I want to talk to you all about Nicki Minaj and her plastic <laughs> and the things that she had to say in regards to the blacks. All right. So Nicki Minaj tweeted and she recently deleted that basically the white media treats her better than the black media. Now, personally, I don't have a problem with Nicki Minaj feeling that the black media or blacks in general really come after her in a very aggressive way more than the white media does. If that's the case, then she's just telling the truth about her situation. But what I do have a problem with is when she refers to our culture as the blacks. The blacks, really? The blacks? You capitalize off of the blacks. But now you want to separate yourself from the community that claimed you because you're not a full-fledged African-American woman. Let's just keep it all the way real. And if I'm not mistaken, guys, her parents are like mixed Indian and Afro-Trinidadian. And just because you have a hint of African-American in your bloodstream does not mean that you're a full-fledged African-American. And let me say this for the people in the back. If you think that Nicki Minaj is a full-fledged African-American, then this tweet that she tweeted out should let you know that she knows that she's not and she's going to play both sides whenever it's convenient for her. That's what people of mixed races do. They play the side that benefits them the best during a particular point in time. And guys, it doesn't take a rocket scientist to figure this stuff out. When someone refers to our culture as the blacks, they're definitely separating themselves from us, but then will turn around and quickly attach themselves back to our culture when it's time to get that bag. But anyway, let's take a look at what this silicone leaking had to say in regards to the blacks and referring to us as the blacks, all right? And it says, Nicki Minaj may have taken her iconic rants a step too far after she posted that the white media is more complimentary to her than the blacks. What the white people post, the blacks only post a few seconds where I raise my voice to push their narrative, she tweeted, adding, hashtag Queen Radio is back in a few days. Stay tuned. Nikki has recently gotten married to Kenneth Zupetti and should be enjoying her time as a newly married woman. But of course, Nikki always makes time to air out her foes on social media. It's not the first time the Megatron rapper has lashed out at the blogs. Now, what I find funny is the fact that she disrespected the black community, right? Separated herself from us. And then within the same sentence, she's telling the blacks that our Queen Radio podcast is going to be coming back shortly and for the blacks to stay tuned because we know that the blacks are the ones that really support her podcast. I'm not here to say that other people from other cultures don't tune into Queen Radio, but it's a high percentage of African Americans, especially young women that really support Nikki and her podcast. But anyway, guys, let's take a look at some of the responses to Nikki's tweet. And one person had to say, you know what? I love your music, but the fact that you said white people and then refer to us as the blacks just furthers the idea that blacks aren't people. That's an idea that goes way back. A mad hurt, unconscious ideas are a blank. You got to be aware of what you're saying. Then someone else says, the funny thing is she is mad at Wendy Williams for speaking the truth, doing her job, which shows how crazy she really is. Nikki is so hypocritical. Meanwhile, she be talking all that blank about people on Queen Radio, but get mad time someone give her that same treatment in return. Then another person says, like blank, I know you don't want to have to censor everything you say, but that's where we are in today's world. Otherwise, you add fuel to the fire for people who already think so little of us black people. And then last but not least, this person says, Nikki really said the blacks, that's your favorite rapper, celeb, person she referred to her own people as blacks that's where you got it wrong captain Nicki minaj is not a full-fledged african-american you know i really wish that my people would stop trying to give everybody a pass just because they may have the same pigmentation of skin color if you know that an individual is mixed that's what they are all right stop trying to say that they're black and also guys let's call Nicki all the way out of the plastic surgeon's office Nicki is one hypocritical Nikki had no problem with that nappy headed ch 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 chia ch 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 chia over there sipping wine, dragging Cardi B in the form and in the fashion that she did, but then gonna turn around and call Wendy demonic because Wendy spoke straight facts about her husband's past. But then Nikki turns around and supports someone that does the same thing that Wendy does, 
but she doesn't view her as a demon but views wendy as a demon i mean that's very hypocritical in my opinion now it's mighty funny when people support the takedown of others but then when people attack them about something that's going on in their lives it becomes the black people the black media and in my opinion she needs to go somewhere and poop that plastic out but anyway, I'm going to let this go and let y'all have at it in the comments. Drop down and let a brother know what you think about this entire situation. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll get with you in the next video, alright? Peace.